Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of Just Rolled In. This car was towed and as a customer says, it still doesn't start after he replaced the battery. The customer left a plastic cover on the negative battery terminal when he installed a new battery. Customer states, after oil change, vehicle is making noise like wind is coming through vehicle. The technician found that the passenger window was slightly opened. He closed it and the noise went away. Windows this car was brought in as the customer says she can't remove the key from the ignition on the car she just bought from this dealership two days prior. The customer had ordered this fluffy pink interior package online, and the cover she installed in the shifter interfered with the shift interlock mechanism. The technician removed the pink cover and it fixed the issue. And this car was towed in as the customer says it won't turn right. The technician took it for a test drive and found the steering wheel cover to be the issue. This customer's wife hit a curb and damaged some wheels and blew out three tires. He declined to purchase new wheels and tried to hammer them straight in the parking lot. When this vehicle was brought in for an overheating concern, the technician noticed it was a load-bearing coconut which between the radiator and exhaust manifold heat shield. And this vehicle was brought in as a customer says they want a bigger screw installed in the oil pan to try and stop the leak. The customer had rounded off the drain plug and thought drilling a hole and putting a screw in the oil pan would work. The customer did not get a new oil pan installed. This vehicle was brought in as the customer says they're having boost issues. The customer had just recently installed a new serpentine belt and mounted it on the wrong side of the belt tensioner, which caused the belt to rub through the turbo inlet pipe over time. Customer states they have a vibration from the rear. The shop told the customer they need a new rear differential and priced out a used one for the customer, but they declined repairs and drove away in four-wheel drive. Tell me all your problems. I want to hear them all. This brand new Honda Pilot was towed in as it has a ton of electrical issues. The customer's now ex-boyfriend installed a sound system and alarm system on his vehicle and spliced into the factory harness and amplifier. The technician said he had to replace the dashboard harness and the body harness and also found one airbag to be missing and hidden cameras in the vehicle. The person who shared this clip said the owner has all of these accessories in his truck as he uses it to hunt for Bigfoot. This 1999 Dodge Ram is quite a fire hazard, but somehow does not have any electrical issues considering all this custom wiring that the customer has done. When this vehicle was in to get a new fuel pump installed, the mechanic found on what he said looked like raw bacon in the fuel tank. When this truck was brought in for a check engine light, the technician noticed an awful grinding noise from the rear and decided to take the wheels off to take a look. The customer declined repairs and said he will fix it himself. You can submit clips that you personally filmed on our website at justrolledinyt.com. I hope you enjoyed this video and please consider leaving a like or subscribing if you haven't already. Thanks for watching.